So we've been asked to work out the total surface area of the triangular prism. So the triangular prism has dimensions uh, 4 for its width, 3 for its height, 7 for its depth, and a slope height of 5. So what we need to realise here then is we're working out the surface area. So we've got 5 surfaces. We've got a triangle at each end, so I'll start with that. So this triangle has a height of 3 and a base of 4. So we would do 3 times 4 divided by 2. But remember there are two triangles, so we're going to need to multiply by 2 as well. So we can cancel these 2's out, and it tells me that the 2 triangles is worth 12. Right, we now have to do the rectangles. Now we have a base rectangle, which is 4 times 7. So you'll see my finger tracing around the base, 4 times 7. Uh, we have, which is 28. We then have the back triangle, so it's 3 times 7. So 7 times 3. 7 3s are 21. And finally we have, maybe this is the most difficult one to see, but we have a rectangle at the front. It's the slope, and it's a 5 times 7, which is 35. 5 times 7, which is 35. So I'll circle everything we need to add up, our triangles, first rectangle, second rectangle, and third rectangle. Now 12 and 28, 12 and 28 is 40. So we'll put that down as 40, plus 21 is 61, and then we've got 61, and 35 gives me 96. So the total surface area of the triangle prism is 96 centimetres squared.